Here we go, first signal. Oh, first batch of roots. And lead. Well, here we are. 1700s, 1800s farm. I've started in the back old field. Cellar hole in that direction, so I'm going to work the backyard area that it used to be and maybe make my way to the cellar hole. I say maybe work my way to the cellar hole because I've been detecting here for years, but have always done around the cellar, which has been great in the past, but I can honestly say I haven't spent too much time out here. Shotgun Willie. Willie again. So as you can see the wall, I'm just going to work my way along the edges. I really need to see what the land is like. So far it's not very flat in there. So we might not end up spending that much time out here. Being it's not improved and there probably wouldn't be that much out here other than ammo. And a relic. Good. Baby spoonball handle. So, there is hope. Yeah. Good. Well, I'm taking a little stroll out back. It's actually worse than I thought. Land improvement wise, it's just pitted and rocky and rolly yeah may have to change direction a little bit i even walked up to check the cellar hole and it's it's all overgrown i was thinking about it it's probably been seven years since i've been to that cellar i have to wait till late fall i don't know guess i'll go that way new plan look familiar yeah it's the place we were in the last video I've been walking around for about an hour. There was no finding anything at that cellar hole. It's the same piece of property as this one, our friend. So I figured I'd come back to where we were finding things. Yeah. What's good is it gave me a chance to do the in-between, which I had never done before, and it's, it's rough land out there. So now I know that. All right, well, this is the area we were finding all the buttons, but that's it, and then it becomes furniture. Let's swing. Nice. A button. Well, I'm glad we came back over. And so if this is a conclusion from the other day, that would be button number seven here this season. We dug close to 50 in total from all the years past, but that's number seven and it is Tomback. Come on, baby. Yes, nice button. Not sounding deep either because of all the rock and such. Not submerging, just like last time. And, might be Tom back. Still, another great button find here.
that seems too good to be true. So what I've done is the cellar hole is behind me. I've ventured off the slope here into the logging area because it's uh, open. knob kind of different too nice well, that's hopeful on the little slope here lead piece of a thing. Wow, the tiniest little buckle. And why is that so wow? Bag, starting point, two days in a row. And I just caught it this time. Just the right angle. That is the coolest looking little thing. Great condition too. So that's why I keep going back and forth. Back and forth. Not that I have much space to work in, but it pays off. Big nail. Nails. front of me. Unreal, another button. Very fragile button. Jeez, all I did was go to flip it over and it broke. Well, that's Tom back for you. Still, that, that is pretty awesome. And, as always, the way it goes, if a site is really good and easy, you definitely do not work as hard as you do when it's more difficult to find things. I mean, I'm working in all this stuff <laughs> as much as I can. And another button. So, beating down the bush. And anything that starts to sound remotely anything other than a nail, we try to isolate. Wow, this ground is so tough. I would. There we go. So not only another button, but the tenth button on the second trip this week after we, you know, hit this place hard years ago. Awesome. Always go back. 
and always work harder.